Megabyte Rock. We've only met just once. But I gotta be honest with you. When I met you back then, I didn't know who you were. I mean, honestly, I thought you were a random guy at a show I was on. Look at you now, right? Ron, you come out with your nice hot dog scarf, your hot dog trunks, you even got a hot dog fanny bag. But Ronnie, if you haven't figured it out yet, I'm calling you out. Yeah, I understand. You've competed in dozens, dozens of hot dog eating competitions. This is one hot dog you're not gonna beat. So it is, and so it always shall be. Let the contest
all I ever wanted for this year was to have Megabyte versus Hotball. Now, I didn't think for one second that this was going to turn into what it turned into. Ronnie, I didn't expect to show up at the Nathan Famous Hot Dog Eating Competition to call you out. I didn't expect to do that, but you know what? I did it. Like a man, I faced you face to face. Man to man, hot dog to hot dog. And what did you do? You accepted the challenge. Yes, you did. Great for you. But you know what you did? You attacked me from behind. Not like a man, more like a megabyte bitch. Ronnie, I knew I wasn't wrong when I said that the first time. Now I'm saying it again. That's exactly what you are. Now, Ronnie, you almost took me out. You almost put me on the shelf. But, Ronnie, that's the thing. You almost did that. You almost beat your personal record. But you didn't. You should have just ended me right there and then. You should have just did it. But you didn't. You let me live. You let me breathe. And, Ronnie, this will forever be the worst mistake you have ever made in your life. Because now, I'm going to make your life a living hell and Ron you better have eyes in the back of your head because you want real hot dog shit I'm gonna give it to you Megabyte Ronnie versus Hot Dog Starks book that shit